all right guys welcome to my investment class welcome i welcome everyone that has uh, made our time to join me here my name is kasimia emeke i'm a digital strategist and investment coach now today i want to introduce us to this class investing in stocks and i want to focus on local stocks so this is what it is the essence of this is to help us locally to build wealth to build wealth because building of wealth is not necessarily or is not in its entirety uh, built around around the salary earners no you have to invest in different phase of business that will make you be able to say you are an investor or you have been able to build wealth that can be transferred from one generation to the other so one of those assets through which you build wealth is investing in stocks investing in stocks in that local stock or foreign stocks stocks uh, investment uh, refers to purchasing shares of publicly traded companies that are based in your local region or country Local stock investment can be an attractive option for several reasons. One of those reasons is that one, you are encouraging uh, community growth because when you invest in a company that is within your locality or in your country, you know you are building wealth within your country. It encourages innovation because when you invest in local stock, of course, you are giving them financial support to be able to diversify in, in, in innovation. So there are a whole lot of attractive uh, options when you invest in your in your local area uh, another thing that also gives a, a attractive option when you invest in your local region is that uh, you are actually building for op business opportunities and also job opportunities because when you invest companies will have money within your locality to build more opportunities and expand when they expand it opens door for more for more employment thereby reducing the level of poverty so there are a lot of it but the essence of what we are doing today is about how you can make money how you can make money what how can you make money now what is stock stocks are shares of ownership in publicly traded companies companies issue them on stock exchange to raise money at which point investors buy and sell them based on their potential to go up in value or pay dividends you see you see what it means is that if you buy a share from a company uh, the, 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 you as an investor you look forward to when the companies uh, 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 when the companies move forward when the companies you know grow in their business thereby giving you that access to be able to benefit from the return on investment also company when they grow like currently uh, i think uh, konoye konoye has also written to all their shareholders and are going to give dividends you know when they give dividends means that from the from the from the business of the company what they make the interest they make they share across their shareholders so buying and holding stocks can help you grow your wealth and reach your long-term financial goal mark that word long-term financial goals now how how to invest in stock market how do you invest in stock market there are there are factors that you must put into consideration you know there are fundamentals that you must follow to be able to invest in stock market you must take a cognizance of them if you put any of them away you may have issues along your investment uh, journey one of it is buying the right investment yes buy buying the right investment how do you buy the right investment As, especially as I said, this is just easier said than done. Uh, uh, you know, it's easier said than done. Why? Because you cannot completely determine the progress of a company, though there are factors 
there are fundamentals that we have put in place to help us decide the right investment yes decide the right investment one of those factors that we use in deciding the right investment is to read about the progress of the company how long they have been and then what investment that the company uh, may have currently or in a few years back are made into the company that will make the company to grow who are the people involved in the company these are what makes your investment your, your invest your decision to choose a particular investment right and then two you must avoid individual stocks yes this is very key please put this into into your mind avoid individual stocks individual stock means that one man owns everything he decides everything and then he has a stock of course anything can happen and that business is gone do you understand that so how do you how do you avoid this kind of thing is to focus on companies that are conglomerate conglomerate companies companies that a lot of persons a lot of big 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 men billionaires have come together to put money into one particular uh, source and then build wealth. These are what you must know. So for you to invest in stock market, you must also create a, a diversified portfolio attitude. How, what do I mean here? I want to give example of this man, Mr. Gabriel uh, uh, Ubeche. Mr. Gabriel Ubeche, that is the sole founder of Kono I mean Rain Oil, sorry. The, the sole founder of Rain Oil. When you read about the story of this man, uh, when he started, he was actually working in a particular company. And as at that time, he shared the story that every month, he's always putting something out and goes to the, uh, you know, because as at that time, 1990s or thereabout, he was buying stocks. You know, stocks were manually controlled as at that time where you have to approach a stockbroker, go to his office and then give him some funds and so to help me and buy stocks. You know, what what I'm going to be showing you is quite different from those local way or manual way of buying stocks. Everything has been digitalized. Yes, I'm going to show you. So from what this man did, he was buying into different stocks, diversifying his portfolio. If First Bank was selling, he buys stock. If Zenith is buying, he was buying. Unilever, uh, Nigerian breweries, you know, a whole lot of uh, stocks as at that time he was buying into their portfolio. So for you that want to also grow in investment, you must create that diversified portfolio to be able to buy so that you don't put all your all your all your eggs or all your tomatoes in one basket. If anything happens, everything is gone. So diversifying is key when it comes to buying into stocks. And now one more thing that you must also know is being aware of the market force. Yes, because market is not always determined for uh, growth, growth, growth. There are factors, there are policies that sometimes affect the market. Even global global uh, issues like when wars, you know, in different areas like today as uh, Ukraine and uh, Russia are in, 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 in war, these things affect the global market. So you must be aware of the market fall so that you don't just feel that everything is rosy, everything is rosy. So when it's growing up, also know that it could fall down. But it, it, when it falls down, it doesn't mean that you are losing the value. I mean, you are losing the value of your unit, you know, so everything is still within. Then as a beginner, you must also try as much as possible if you are not following my own class because I could be your demo trading account. Yes, by giving you all you need to know why going through the journey of investing or trading so we give you platform that will enable you to do demo trading 
you know the platform i'm going to give to you you can run a demo trading where you have some naira or some dollar you trade them and see how you can perform your decision it helps you to also know that when you come into real-time investment you can as well do well then the next is creating a long-term portfolio yes creating a long-term portfolio i've seen a lot of my a lot of my uh, uh, client they come to me and say oh i want to invest one million naira and i want in the in the space of two months i want to make at least two hundred thousand naira out of it because i want to do this i want to do that the first thing i tell them is that i do not i do not enter into any agreement of uh, trading for any of my client on the basis of short-term goal i don't do that yes it's my policy i don't do that investment building wealth is a long-term thing i've never seen any anyone around the world that has built wealth within the shortest or within short-term goal no it has always been a long-term goal take apple for instance take amazon for instance take tesla for instance take facebook you can see facebook take netflix you see these are companies look at zenith bank look at uh, gt bank look at dangote look at Boa cement you know look at uh, look at the uh, uba these are companies that didn't just fall into wealth in one day they built wealth along the line on long-term goal that is why you see a lot of companies you see them uh, after growing for some years they now put on their description since you know like first bank will always write since 18 whatever whatever so these are long-term goals today they are enjoying the benefit of their long-term investment so you must create a long-term portfolio then the next is starting right away starting right away after this class after this class for everyone that want to start immediately i will give you that access to join my monthly uh, advanced class i only entertain those who are investors yes why because when it comes to this level once you get to this level we will become serious it's about money it's about building wealth so start right now and then next is never think short-term trading don't ever think short-term trading it's very dangerous it's dangerous yes because I, what i teach you is not ponzi i teach you real-time growth real-time wealth creation so you must build the attitude of long-term uh, uh, investment not short-term trading don't ever think that if you want short-term trading maybe you can think about forex trading forex trading we say daily you can lose all your money at once but in the stock market you can never lose your unit your investment that is the share unit even if the value of the share falls down the unit itself remains for instance you bought 10,000 units of a particular share if the value at the moment you bought that share is five naira for instance and after five months or six months or one year the the value of that of that of that shares falls down to two naira the unit itself that you bought will never will never fall down it remains which gives you that that privilege which gives you that confidence that whenever this company is growing back the shares the unit of your shares will start gaining value these are what i'm going to be putting together to show you then the next is keep investing over time this is wonderful i always tell people do not just put one naira today and say oh i'm leaving that 500 naira or that 500 000 there to remain whatever it brings i'm going to i'm going to 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 gain from it now let me give you an, an example for those of you who are who are civil servants of course you build to for retirement that when you retire you begin to receive gratuity and uh, and pension do you know that your pension is built over time your pension is built over time now this is what it is that every month there is a there is an amount that is moved from your uh, from your salary to put in your in your retirement or uh, uh, account yes 
terminal to account. So what it means is that even the government understand the, the essence or the benefit of investing over time. Though that one does not convert into interest, it's only stagnant there, it's only static. So that is what you do here as you invest. Always invest. I have a wife that works in, the, in an hospital and what I tell her every month, she put out 20,000 for, for stock investment. Yes, and she diversify. That is how you build wealth. So if you are following me, you must also build that attitude of investing over time. Now, this is the big deal. How to invest from your home using reliable platform. Whatever I'm teaching you today is just as I'm, right, I'm, right, I'm sitting right before my computer in my bedroom. Yes, in my bedroom, not even in my office, in my bedroom at this time of the day. So you too, I'll teach you how you can be even while in your office you, with your smartphone, how you can now start investing. You don't need to go to a stockbroker. You don't need all those ones because you have to be paying them. You don't need all those ones. You use your smartphone and make your money and build your wealth over time. Yes, yeah, secretly you build it. By the time you start building, you begin to see the benefit of it. So uh, I'm going to show you how you can create an account using this platform. It's, it's, purely, it's purely a digital platform. Yes, a digital platform that is regulated and controlled or being uh, monitored by the Central Bank of Nigeria. Though it is not only for Nigeria, it is, it is both international because it's an international organization that you invest in. You can invest, uh, buy stock of foreign, foreign market or you buy stock of the local market. So I will show you how you can now create your account. You can get it approved with ease and then start investing. Whatever amount that you are putting, you will see how it will grow. So guys, I want you to stick with me. One more thing I want you to also do if today is your first time to come to my class or following me, I would like you to follow me on my YouTube, also follow me on my Facebook account, Facebook page, and then click on the notification button so that anytime I put up program like this that will benefit you, you will also get notified and then you can follow me. So you can also share as well, share and make comment. These are what will help me to also reach more people just as I'm seeing I'm reaching you. So follow me, click on the notification button, make comment, also share this link. So let's dive into my computer and see how everything is worked the steps, the practical steps, because it's not about talking, talking, talking. We need to practicalize. We need to do real time and see how these things work. So follow me as we go.